Yeah. A reunion of seven retired firefighters Don't tell me you're through. was over in a matter of minutes. Each one simplifies it. took a quick blood test at cancer check labs. The retirees know after decades on Dallas Fire Rescue, they are at higher risk for cancer. Every one of us here has stories of people we work with who've died of cancer. Daniel DeYear served 45 years, 32 of those with Dallas, and retired as deputy chief. We wish this existed the day we came on the job. When he met Sumit Rai. The key to curing cancer is to catch it early. The founder of Cancer Check Labs. We all want a negative test. Yes. DeYear knew they were on the same page. If it's not, the next step will be to go back to a physician, primary care, and, and we can help coordinate that as well. With breakthrough technology. But at least then we know. Rai says a blood drop can identify more than 200 types of solid tumors. All tumors are known to shed in order to spread. It is changing the game in early detection of cancer. Those machines over there were able to extract these whole ex tumor cells intact such that we can put them on a glass slide. So that way we can grab the tissue without actually having to go in for a surgical biopsy. Painless. Today they started with seven retirees. Negative would be good for me. And I <laughs> Yeah. But their new 501c3 nonprofit called Adopt a Firefighter is aiming to help more. We want to be the heroes behind the heroes. Yeah. <laughs> their efforts are launching in Dallas, Highland Park, and Park City, donating a thousand tests and raising money to provide a thousand more. I think it'll be revolutionary in the fire service. That'll cover every firefighter in those departments. And if you test 2,000 firefighters in Dallas, that number's going to have three digits to it. I'll promise you that. By screening early, those who save lives could be saved too. Thank you, ma'am. Thank you. In Thank Dallas, you. Uh -huh. I'm Tiffany Liu.